Okay, hello. This is my second time taping this um, because, yeah, I'm just not really computer savvy. I have it on a new tripod that somebody sent me so that I could review it, and I'm just not real technical, and Greg's not here. So, I wanted to share um, a haul video of some things that I've gotten. Um, I don't know if you've heard of Sweet Georgia May's um, Etsy shop. Um, I will link her shop. I got the confetti washi from her. They were all brand new in the package. And a bunch of the thin bow washi. Um, she's running a special IPR for her. I will put my PR code in the in the description. And um, tomorrow, through tomorrow, she's having 30% off. And she has some grab bags and things, a lot of crafty things, clips, all kind of things like that. Then I got my order from Planning City Stickers. I will link her shop in the description. I got a grab bag. I had a, I earn points when you buy and you accumulate points and then you get so many dollars off or whatever, but I earned a $5 credit. The grab bag was $5, so all I paid was for the shipping. And these are, she's very generous. Got computers. I love the mini sticker sheets. That's the face wash, face brush. These are my favorites. Get gas, air in the tires. Alarm clocks. Lunch bags. Happy mail. Dirty laundry or laundry that needs to be folded. Little handprints, which I'm getting ready to have a new granddaughter in about a month. So those will come in handy. Washing machine. Cell phone, and it says, hey. PR post. And then little boxes and I'm gonna get some of the foil overlays to go over these so that it makes them so cute actually I think I have some and then the scallop boxes and then I mentioned Hensley's name and I got her PR freebie and gold foil cleaning is the only way to go and then I won a, a couple weeks ago I got an email saying I have won a $50 shop credit to Charlotte's Paper Company and um, I was so excited because I had heard and seen been checking them out all of the sticker albums well I finally got two and of course I got all the glitter but her sticker albums because I got the foiled ones I think they were 17 I'll link her shop. But um, each album has 60 pages, so you can put 120 um, sheets of stickers in there. So I got that one. And then one of my favorites is the coffee. Again, I love them. Can't wait to get all my stickers organized. And then I got a sheet of that says haul video with the holographic foil I got a mini clip so cute it's like the faux leather with the glitter and it's just tiny I don't like I have a hard time with a lot of things sticking out of my planner because they will get broken because I throw it in my purse so um, I like little tiny clips like that here's a freebie I got boxes she gives you a die cut sticker that says Charlotte's paper her card and then I got a grab bag and these fit Erin Condren but because I'm a daily planner and I'll show you my planner for this week coming up I can make any kit work in my planner and I usually mix them match I just go with what works for me. Chore day, craft day with the girls. 
not a whole lot Wednesday and Thursday and I'm okay with that and then Friday and Saturday is that right oh no I skipped the page Friday and Saturday so that's my planner for this week and um, this kit has the glitter headers. I'm not big into Halloween, and these are a little more um, mild and toned down a little bit. Um, I just, I come from an abusive second marriage, and so I have to do a lot of healing. I don't like to be scared, and I don't like the dark, and um, so Halloween's not one of my favorite times. But, um, but I'm all about that fall because November's my birthday month. You get your date headers, some washi, your icons, your list boxes. You see they're very faint little pictures of these, of your full boxes. A little witch, a couple spiders, love the pumpkins. I can do that. And then this one is so cute. It's kind of rustic fall one. You get your glitter headers. Love these colors. Look at these washi and the date covers. She has very good paper quality and sticker quality and vibrant colors. Your list boxes. And then look at these full boxes. So pretty. And one of the, I got two kits right here in this grab bag. And I can probably plan about two or three weeks off of each, off of one kit. So, um, more than enough for me. Then, I, I've been trying to do this video all day. I've been waiting for the Amazon guy to come. And, um, and he was late. I mean, he's not usually that late. Of course, I have to kind of, I always meet him at the door because I kind of stalk him. But, um, and he was running and I'm like, oh, you're running a little late, blah, 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 blah. He's like, yeah, I had a little accident. I'm like, oh, you wrecked your car? Wrecked your truck with all those packages in it? He's like, no, I skinned up my knees. I was running to try to catch up with my deliveries and get on time and he fell and skinned his knees up. And I said, did you break anything? And he said, um, no, no, just skip skin up my knees. And I said, um, I wasn't talking about you. I was talking about the packages. And he just cracked up laughing. I thought he was going to throw up a lung. And, um, so then I gave him a bottle of lemonade. And I said, don't run with it because, you know, I'm not taking the risk of you getting cut. But, um, I told him, I said, you got to stay steady on your feet because that's online shoppers that love to sit at home in our jammies and do late night shopping expect our packages to arrive without blood on them so anyways amazon i discovered this red tape double-sided tape it comes out clear but it's super sticky none it is i, I use it more than i use um glue i like it Nothing falls off in the mail. I used to use this double-sided tape, just regular double-sided tape you could get for like 99 cents at Joann's in the little dollar bin. Yeah, I don't use that anymore. <clears throat> and then, I was telling you, um, on Tuesdays I go craft with some of my friends and I, I don't like to unpack my bag when I come home and repack it every week. So I have like a big bulky um, paper cutter in there. And this one is smaller. Normally I use this, but I can't cut my 12 by 12 paper with that. That's just for my little stuff. But this one pulls out and you can cut 12 by 12 paper. And um, actually goes up to 13 and a half. And then I don't have to keep getting that bulky one out of my my bag to um and then I already got this out of the package because I 
Um, <laughs> this is my second go through with taping this. I can't find where it is, but it's like a little ball, a little paper. I'll find it. But you get a 12 by 12 sticker sheet. I love the tractor. I love that they add the turquoise in. You get 12 12 by sheet, 12, 12 by 12 sheets. You get cut aparts. I love the turquoise. Now your owls and your plaid. That reminds me of a sweater back in the 70s. And I just told you how old I am. I really don't remember the 70s. I was just a toddler. I was kind of, part of time. You get this one and some bigger four by six cut aparts. Love the tractor. And then you get this one. And this, call, this kit is called um, My Favorite Fall by Lori Whitlock. And I will link it in the description. So if you're interested in it, you can find it on Amazon. Love the tractors. You get the little tiny cut aparts. And then all the animals. Can't wait to craft with this. And you get more cut aparts. These are like three by four. So you get three different sizes of cut aparts. And then the last sheet. So that one is my favorite fall. And then I got one more sticker kit because I have not been shopping at Tuesday morning or Joann's. All this stuff was free. I paid $1.66 for it. Um, I paid $7 for my shipping in Charlotte's Paper Company. And I paid $3 for shipping on my order from Planning City Stickers. I'm a very thrifty shopper. And maybe I'll have a video soon or we'll do a live maybe and you can ask questions and stuff in a link maybe I'll start sharing my secrets of how I do mystery shopping and earn money from home um, it's taken me three years to get here and to build up this one's called perfect autumn by Lori Whitlock And this one you get um, 12 12 by 12 double sided papers and a 12 by 12 element sticker. And I like that this one is different. The turquoise is a little darker. I can't wait to craft with this. Some of it I'm going to use it as matting because I'm going to have a new granddaughter and um, my grandson will be a year. So I'm going to use it some some matting and some pictures. Now this one's cute. Look at all the box. And remember, if you say more than one box, You know, like a goose is geese. Do you say fox or foxes? I, I think you, you add ES when it's plural. You just had a moment in my brain. I would Google it if my phone wasn't videoing. Here's some really starry eyed owls. I 
really cute. These will make great cards, embellishments. And then you have, I think, three sheets of cut-aparts. You have the three by four. And then you have some four by six. And I'll craft with some of these cut-aparts, but a lot of times I use them as a, like if I'm sending a swap or something, I will use them as a little card and write, you know, a little greeting and, you know, have a happy day on it. And then the last one is just borders. Blessed beyond measure. Love that. And then you get the sticker sheet. This is really kind of a little wicked skunk there. And as you'll know, Lori Gallimore, if you're watching, there are no fall snakes. You guys know what? I have to tell you a story. So I was looking at my planner and I couldn't remember. I'm like, what is this? You know, is it like, I thought I remembered reading where it said ostrich. And I said, Lord, this is an ostrich. Ostrich have feathers. And she showed me what ostrich looked like. I mean, this is faux, it's not real. And so we got to looking at it and she started Googling it and Pinterest it. And I have a great phobia of snakes, a great phobia. And these are like faux scales. And I'm like, oh, it must be a nice little crocodile or alligator, you know, a faux alligator. I'm sure that's what it was. And um, no, come to find out, yeah, Kimberly, it was a, um, yeah, it's like a snake. Mm-hmm. It, for some reason, I'm convinced since moving to California that there are rattlesnakes around. You know, I've read a lot of books. A lot of them, true stories. I'm not stupid. I, I, of course, we do live in town. But back in Indiana, I lived in town, too. And um, somebody let their little albino boa constrictor out one day and just la dee -da, there he comes down the street. So anyways, anything is possible here, but if there's a snake here, it will find me or I will find it. I just know it. Yeah, and I got this great traveler's notebook, which I love. I love an A6. I love, this is just, it's my planner. I made it my own and yeah, and I brought a snake into our home. So, but that is my haul. I will link everything in the description. Leave me a comment. Um, it was good to get on here and kind of have somebody to try and talk to. So I love getting comments because Greg's at work all day. Um, I have to go do a mystery shop. Um, it'll take me about five minutes um, and I'll get paid like 10 bucks. So, um, but maybe I'll get to a point, as long as you don't live in my area where you can take my gigs, then I might share. I might share, but what if somebody finds out and gets on my YouTube from Pittsburgh and they start taking all my shops? Well, I have so many, I can't even keep up anyway, so. People email me every day to do them. So, um, have a wonderful, um, blessed weekend. And um, I'll be back on soon. I'm gonna do some crafting this week and I'll do some project shares and I'll get my sticker albums um, set up. I loved that I had almost 300 views on my ultimate sticker storage video, which I did before this, because I, um, that's the most I've ever done, but that is the best way to do sticker storage when you have all those sticker books. I just pull them out, my binders, and I just set them around me, and I can find everything. So anyways, I'm just rambling, but, um, have a wonderful weekend, and, um, I will go and get this uploaded. Bye.